everyone. This is Nick with City Rock Hunting. And in today's video, we're trying to make it out to Wetlands Field. Might not make it there though in time. Too many pretty things to see along the way. Plus all the cool rocks that I'm seeing along the gravel path here. It's hard not to stop and look. Too many distractions. But I appreciate everyone stopping by. And I'll show you what we find today. Thank you. First cool find of the day here. Looks like a piece of shirt to me. That's got some cool colors inside there, I like that. A little thin, but still cool. So I saw this really cool favorite sighties piece here, but then I also spotted another one. You can see that honeycomb pattern in there on the top. That's pretty cool. Cool little side wall structure there. That's a nice piece. And then also, pudding stone. That's cool. Broken up piece. A little jasper and chert there. And a quartzite matrix. That's really cool. Excited for that. Well, you can really see the waxiness on this one. That's awesome. Sorry for that. Nice. That's super cool. I like that. Next couple finds I'm super excited about. Cool piece of unikite there. You can see that green epidote and the pinkish red feldspar. That's really cool. Excited for that one. And also, really cool piece, stromatolite. That's a cool one. Lots of detail in there. That's awesome. Almost walked over that. Glad I turned around. That's sweet.
Looks like an interesting piece of chert there. Hard to tell if that's little banding with pockets or what's going on there. It's kind of interesting though. Take that one home, clean it up. Very cool. Looks like there's another kind of strange looking one here. Not really sure what's going on there, but it looks cool. Not sure if that's quartz in there or what. Interesting though. Seen this really cool piece of looking chert. Then I also saw what looks like a fossil next to it. Possibly horn coral. Looks like that's got some pretty color to it. That's nice. And also, yep, definitely some horn coral. That's super cool. You can see a little bit there on the back side. That's awesome. Definitely find horn coral everywhere out here. So we're off to the side of the gravel trail here. Found this really big boulder of granite. Figured that'd be a good spot to take a break and show you some rocks here that we found. Some pretty cool stuff. Nice death plate here. Looks like some coral on this side. But then I see a couple different things on that side. Horn, little baby horn coral. Brachiopod shell. Next up, this really cool piece of what I believe is Syringopora. Could be wrong. Let me know what you think. Either way, it's a really cool piece. I like that. And then this really awesome piece of horn coral. That's really cool. Kind of a section view through it. That's really sweet. Excited for that one. Really pretty piece of chert here. I like the colors. And I can't help but take anything that's waxy. Not sure what this one was. Possibly inside of a geode or something. It's definitely some microscopic ag agate banding there little eyes it's not picking it up the greatest on camera but that's a really pretty piece super cool grateful for that
So we're off in the woods again, next to the road, on this down tree. That's got a bunch of puffball mushrooms on it. Show you the next couple finds we have. That's kind of cool. Some potpourri there. Don't typically find that here, so that's awesome. I was just talking to a worker a couple minutes ago, and he was telling me that all the rocks for the roads here are brought in locally. They owned a lot of land, and on one of the corners of the land, they have a little quarry that they dig out, get some rocks, so I'm going to have to find that. Here's a piece of Syringopora. That's a really cool piece. I like that. This really awesome piece of Favorsites. Can really see that honeycomb pattern there. That's beautiful. I like this one a lot. Really cool piece of Unicate. A lot of epidote on that one. Looks like the epidote and feldspar didn't want to mix together on this one. That's really cool though. And then a really cool piece of shirt. I like that. Nice color to it. So we're next to the wetlands preserve here. Still about a mile away from wetlands field, which is on the opposite side of this. Doesn't look like we're going to make it there today. Tomorrow's another day. Won't get distracted next time. I say that, but we'll see. Really cool piece of Unikite again. Just a little sliver of it, but still. I love that color. Not really positive on what this one was. It's definitely a fossil. Not sure if that's horn coral or what, but that's really cool. Best guess is horn coral. Still awesome detail on that. I like that one a lot. And this one definitely is horn coral. Really cool piece of it. That's probably my favorite one of the day today, horn coral wise. That's awesome. Super excited for that.
that's going to do it for today's video. I really appreciate everyone stopping by and hope everyone has a great rest of your day. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Bye.